How about some LSU Tigers? They got a big weekend this weekend, and they are going to be welcoming in a bunch of big time commits. And we are welcomed by uh, Dave Hooker, regional uh, recruiting nation reporter. And Dave, LSU looking for a win against Florida, but also looking to win over some recruits. Tell us who's making the trip to Baton Rouge this weekend. Well, there's certainly plenty of big names uh, with Beckwith and Williams, but I, I think the one that's most interesting to me, at least, is uh, Reuben Foster. Here's a young man who's been committed to Auburn some time, for quite some time. Uh, you know, he's formerly all about Alabama and then goes to Auburn, and before Auburn season begins to fall apart, I think we're all talking about how great their recruiting is going. Well, this could be the first major crack, if not a fisher, in uh, Auburn's recruiting, especially if they don't improve on the field really, really quick. You know, I'm told that uh, Reuben Foster even has uh, an Auburn tattoo. I don't know what he's going to do with that if he ends up at another school like LSU. But LSU clearly has plenty to sell. The uh, game environment will be fantastic. It's one of the best in the nation, bar none. And then the other thing, they can point to several – uh, prospects in, in their front seven throughout the previous few years that have made it onto the NFL that have been dominant college players. So this one is just now starting to get interesting, but it could get really interesting if, if Auburn can't get it going on Saturdays. Dave Hooker, Recruiting Nation, appreciate it. And luckily for Reuben Foster, the tattoo is an AU, so I suppose that still opens the door to some other A schools. Uh, the number two player in the nation committed to Auburn, but LSU certainly has not stopped recruiting.